Hello everybody. Today we're going to look at two of my photo cells that have been broken so you can take the top off and, and we will look at the inside. Now this one is a Fisher Pierce photo cell. It was made in Toronto, Canada. It is 120 volt. And this one is a Lumatrol, Luma sorry, Mark III. And it is 230 volts. We'll start with this one. Take the cover off, and as you can see, the cover is very yellowed from use. And in here, you can see right here is the photo cell itself. And we can, and this little grate here is there so you can adjust it for whatever time you want it to turn on or at whatever brightness. Now this photo cell is round as you can see. And there is a um, capacitor right here. We'll turn it around and you can see some other components and a bimetal switch right here. And it's all on this little board in the middle, circuit board. And on the bottom you can see the gasket and the prongs. And that is the two Oops, that's the 230 volt one made by Lumatron. Let me get this on here, right? Oh, come on. Hold on here. There we go. That's the Lumatron Mark III. And over here, we have the Fisher Pierce one that was made in Toronto, Canada. Now this one, as you can see, one of the th um, holders broke here. So I'm going to have to set the camera down for a minute and take it off. And there we go. And now, here we can see it open. There it is. You can see something burned in there. The cover. And here's the inside of the Fisher Pierce photo cell that is 120 volt. As you can see, the photo cell is square. And this one also has a grate, so you can choose how much light is going to oops, go through the photo cell itself. So we'll push that back down in there. And as you can see, you can hold it up to the light here. You can see it kind of, you can see the pattern of the photo cell there. It goes through the back. And now you can see there's some type of ballast or transformer. That must be some type of switch right there. Now that, this right here was where the burnt spot was on here. So that must have smoked or something. I don't see a bimetal switch. It's probably hidden on this one somewhere. Nope, there it is, right there. That's the bimetal switch. There's not a capacitor in this one. And that one is a Fisher Pierce um, 120 volt photo cell. Get this back on there correctly. And those are my two photo cells that have been broken open so you can see the inside. Thank you.